Okay, let's look at our adult management screen. You can get to the screen by going to adults, then adult management. On this screen, you have a grid where you can filter by each one of these columns, or you can sort by each one of these columns. If you'd like to filter and just show your adult leaders, click the little filter, say it's equal to yes, and click filter. It's only going to show you the yeses in this column. You can also add a new adult by clicking add new. And let's go ahead and take a look at um, Mr. James Osborne. Click view. And here you see his status screen. Get a brief overview of his personal emergency medical remarks, documents. Each person in the system can have their own individual documents uploaded to the site. He's got one document uploaded so far. You also have his leadership positions, order of the arrow, make a say, his training status. Right now he's got something wrong with this training. Um, he's not completely trained at the moment. Let's go ahead and look at that and see, um, see what's going on with this training. Okay, so it tells us right up here. He's partially trained. He's missing courses Y01, uh, which is youth protection training. Looks like it expired on 8 of 2016. So let's go ahead and update that for him. Let's go ahead and say that he, he took that today and click save. Okay, you can see the little hazard signs gone, the expired message is gone. And on his status screen, he's got a little check mark indicating that he is fully trained for his leadership position. On this screen, you can also get to his special awards, vehicles, and service years. Let's take a look at this screen on our mobile device. Okay, so this is the scout management screen on a mobile device. Let's search for Mr. Osborne. Okay, just start typing in his last name and it'll start filtering out everybody with the same last name. You can also filter by the word trained or his leadership position or whatever text or is on the screen, you can start typing it in and it'll start filtering out for you. Let's go ahead and click on Mr. Osborne. And you've got the same information. You've got his personal info, his emergency medical, his training. You can see all this from a mobile browser as well. You can even edit this content. Same for his emergency medical. If you need to look any of that up, just click on it and you'll have it. Let's look at the same screen over here on the desktop. Let's say we wanted to update his picture here. Uh, it's very easy to do. Just click photo, select image, and just center his face within that little box and click OK. And that's how you put an image into the system. Once you're done, click save. Okay, and if in the future uh, this particular adult becomes a Merit Badge Counselor, all you have to do is come to his adult screen, check the NBC box, click Save, and he'll be added as a Merit Badge Counselor as well. You can also give him a special award.
update his vehicular information. And that's about it for the adult management screen.